So the modified rods are on the track for the modified rod stars. Scott Foy in the 57. The six is Alan Harris. The seven, John Brown. 69, Clint Cosgrove. 21, Ray Tyler. And zero, Tony Hopping. Turbocharged sneeze there in the control tower. <coughs> and the 57 car of Scott Foy. On the pole line, Alan Harris on the outside of him will be anxious to go fast. Seemed to have some handling problems in his first event. Getting set. Scott Foy and Alan Harris playing a little bit of cat and mouse on the front row of the grid. The car on the inside is the car that should dictate the pace coming to the start area. And that is the 57 car of Scott Foy. So just got a slight delay. We apparently require some uh, ambulance attention to one of our patrons uh, here uh, behind the control tower. We have another ambulance officer on the infield, so we'll be able to continue with the race. We're just letting our ambulance officer safely across. We can't hurt Bruce. One of our uh, champions from the national uh, ambulance competition that was conducted a couple of weeks ago. We congratulate him for that. And another one of our ambulance officers, Dave Higgins, receiving a bravery award during the week. Dave uh, comes regularly to the Motodrome too, so we have nothing but the best here at the uh, Newcastle Motodrome. Even our ambulance officers are top guns. So we'll see if we can get a start this time round in our Tui's Modified Rod Stars race. Set. was okay. Alan Harris on the outside got the best of it. Tony Hopping going out very quickly too. Now again, Harris having a distinct handling problem coming out of turn two. So that car still not going the way he'd like it to. Scott Foy the leader. Tony Hopping has got through into second place very quickly. Alan Harris having problems. Scott Foy having a few problems coming out of turn two as well. And Tony Hopping is about to pounce on this lead. Slams into the back end of Scott Foy who's going very slowly at the moment. And Tony Hopping wants him to go a little quicker. Scott Foy throwing the car into turn one two. I thought he was almost going to throw it in the left-hand side of Tony Hopping's car there for a moment. Hopping up on the outside. Scott Foy down low on the inside. Hopping got the better of that turn. And now Hopping will take up the running with three to go. Hopping leads from Scott Foy. Then there's a break to Clint Cosgrove, Ray Tyler, John Brown and Alan Harris having a dog of a night in that car of his. It just will not handle for him tonight. Down main straight away. Only two laps to go. And Hopping is the leader. Scott Foy in second place. He really throws the car into turn one. Scott Foy he gives it a real back end twitch as he gets uh, just near our cameraman. In fact, he gives it the big twitch. There he goes, throwing it into turn one. But Tony Hopping is our uh, leader. Scott Foy is second. Clint Cosgrove is third. John Brown is fourth. And Alan Harris on the tail of the field. But it's checkered flag time and a strong win to Tony Hopping. Scott Foy, then Clint Cosgrove, John Brown and Alan Harris. We've got our two East Trophy to present to our uh, winner, Tony Hopping. There are people in this country work hard every day and not for fame or fortune do they strive but the fruits of their labor are worth more than their pay 
And it's time a few of them will recognize. Hello, Hunter. Coal miner, let me thank you for your time. You work hard all week for a living. How do you feel around that about time? This is for the one who swings the hammer. Driving home the nail. For the one who fights the fire. For the one who brings the mail. For everyone who works behind the scenes. And with some uh, steam pouring from that car, I wonder whether the car feels like a Tui's or two at the moment. Tony, on behalf of Tui's, congratulations on taking out our Stars Dash. Please accept that trophy to uh, add to your sideboard. And uh, I guess you'll be pretty happy that uh, that race has come out a little better than the previous one. Uh, the modified rods have been going very quickly in recent weeks. You've got the record of knocking over Bob McCready here, and it looks like you might be a uh, favourite for the uh, feature a little later on too. Yeah, I hope so. After the first heat happened, you know, I uh, can't blame Barry Bundy, he broke a drive shaft, but we only just made that. We broke steering arms and exhaust pipes and everything, but we just managed to get out of the track, and now I'm happy the car's working good. Certainly is working uh, well. The track looks as if it'll bed down to be nice and sticky too later on, and this open wheel division for the sprint cars and the modifiers are going to give us plenty of action. We'll look forward to that later. Yeah, this would have to be the best track of the season so far. It's brilliant. OK, Tony Hopping will be back. Give him a, a, a big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. He's taken out our Tui's Trophy Dash tonight, and he'll be back for more action a little later on.